Hi, hey, welcome to my channel. I'm your host Bless G, and today we got our first episode of Learn to Play. We're going to look at the Zorg vs Prados basic tree base opening. Let's get in the game. Before I'll give you the build order really quick, and it will be in the description below also. So if you want to switch the build, if you want to skip the build order, uh, me telling you the build order, it's gonna be around five minutes or something. So here we go. <clears throat> First, you got your nine overlord. With this nine overlord, you got to spot cannon at your natural, and your third base. Third base is for the proxy. Any any proxy, I mean, air or ground, whatever. At 15, your pool. 16 H. 15 overlord. 15 queen so you make no more drones until you get this queen after you make one pair of ling you're gonna saturate your main with 16 drone so that's mean you will need another drone then then you're going to 23 at 23 you make another lord your drone till 31 at 31 you're gonna make another overlord at 31 you're gonna also make another queen you're gonna inject with your natural queen and switch it to your third base and you're going to draw until 41 at 41 it's gonna be another overlord then you're going to draw to 44 and at 44 it's gonna be another overlord and another queen this is for spreading purples and you're going to bring her back if you don't lose it for a macro hatch injection at this point you're gonna be around six minutes so you're gonna put down your double gas you're gonna make them mine as soon as they come out and you're going to draw to 70 that's max saturation you don't need more than 75 drone at all time in every matchup. If you go past 75 drones, you're going to eat on the army supply you need. Now that you put your double gas on and your mining gas, your first hundred of gas is going to be your layer, and you're you're going to add another gas on on this on your natural. This is important and after another hundred of gas you're going to add another another gas on your natural so now you're going to be at four gas and you're going to do your speedling speedling sorry this is at 100 gas so now you're around six minutes you're around six minutes seven minutes and you got uh, your you got four gas, three base saturated, and uh, you're kind of good to go for any kind of composition your Prados enemy can go on, even immortal sun tree all in. Yeah. So let's get in the game. This is a. Uh, this was the quick build order. Now I'm gonna show you. This game is versus uh, computer, and as you see, it's uh, versus uh, com a computer with Zerg and not Protoss. But I don't really care because this was only for video purpose. This was uh, just to show the tree base opening versus Protoss. Now, when my overlords go out, I'm going to make two drones more and put thir 13. 14 now. At 15, I'm going to make my pool, just right there. Got two more drones. And make my 16 hatchery. There you go, 16 hatchery. After this, 
I do make another drone, but you don't have to. You need your queen when this is going. You need your queen and an overlord. Now, as you see, I'm supply block because I made that drone before my overlord. I should make my overlord before that drone. Now, I'm gonna queue up another queen and check with this one. And checks are really important. Oh yeah, and uh, at 21, now it's 22, I'm going to make my third base ready to go. I was over 16 on my main base, so I switched it to my natural. I'm gonna inject and send this queen to inject the natural. Keep making drones to 31. Make an overlord. I injected with this one on my on my natural and switch it to my third. Now I'm gonna drone and see six minutes forty four made two gas. Make sure to keep injecting. I'm gonna make them mine as quickly as I can. And I'm waiting, I'm keep droning and I'm waiting for my first hundred of gas deaths. I'm gonna make my lair with it. And another gas with my hundred my other hundred, I'm gonna make my speedling and add another gas to it. Make sure there are three three. There you go. Eight thirty. We are eight at eight thirty. I got four gases. Sixteen sixteen. Sixteen. So three base, three base full saturated in mineral, and two base full saturated in gas. At this point, I'm ready to go versus anything. So even immort immortal central in. If you want to deal with immortal central in, which I'm gonna talk way more in my next learn to play video. You will need right now at 8 minutes, 8.30, you will need a macro hatch, you make a macro hatch, and I didn't make it this time, but uh, at 44 you should make a 44 queen for spread, and you're going to uh, a, a spread, spread group with it, you just bring it back for uh, injection on macro hatch. Then, uh, at this point, if he's going Immortal Island, you should notice, since at 7.30, your butt, but your Overlord, your 9 and your uh, 15 Overlord should be positioned at this place, at the natural and their main base. And at 7.30, you're going to just uh, scout with it. And spot this. If you got immortals, then you know it's going for immortals. You should spot the robotics going on, and no, uh, no, uh, nothing else. Just robotics and sentry at the main base. You're just going to make a lot of roach. Make sure to take your butt, butt of your third base gaze, gases and uh, make a macro hatch, inject with it, don't miss inject, make your roach warren also and just go for uh, mass roach until you have no more gas and when you get no more gas you make mass links. You keep uh, the lord. It's hard to tell how many supply you need to all this, it's, depend it's really depend on your micro but as more as you, more you got, more you're safe. That's what I got to tell. You don't really need stasis defense because it's gonna cost you larvas, 
and you don't you can't you can't spend larva on drones anymore so if you're gonna make your your gas you just take it from here for those already manning those already alive but for uh, gathering uh, gathering uh, relative or making relative that's it for now so this was the build order tree base opening versus Pradas as a zerg I'm gonna make uh, my next video is gonna be learn to play also and it's gonna be uh, how to uh, deal with the immortal all in century by deal I mean uh, force them to force field you and waste their fulfill worth their mana and this way is gonna be way more easy to deal with it so thank you for watching and uh, hope you enjoyed it the Pildoro will be in the description below and uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel it's uh, really appreciated make sure to like this video if you liked it don't uh, be shy to ask any question I, res I answer every question you will ask me and if you got anything you need to know uh, about anything just tell me and I'm gonna make sure to respond to you as quickly as I can. So again, thank you for watching, guys, and uh, see you in your in your my next video of learn how to play. Thank you.